Muses in Greek mythology. The Muses are goddesses who were believed to inspire creativity in humans. They were said to be the daughters of Zeus and Nemesai, the goddess of memory. There were nine Muses in total. We will be diving into the stories of each of these goddesses and exploring their unique abilities. Calliope, the muse of epic poetry. Calliope was the muse of epic poetry and was often depicted holding a writing tablet and a stylus, and her name means beautiful voice. She was said to have inspired the great poets of ancient Greece, such as Homer and Hesiod. According to legend, she was the mother of Orpheus, the legendary musician and poet. Cleo, the muse of history. Cleo was often depicted carrying a scroll or a set of books, and she was said to have inspired the great historians of ancient Greece. Cleo was known for her ability to help people remember important events and keep records of history. Her name means to make famous, and she was often called upon to help immortalize important figures and events in Greek history. Dorado, the muse of love poetry. Dorado was the muse of love poetry and was often associated with Eros, the god of love, was often depicted holding a lyre and her name means lovely or beloved. She was said to inspire poets and artists to create works that expressed the beauty and passion of love. She was also believed to have the power to make people fall in love through her poetry and music. Euterp, the muse of music, Euterp was the muse of music and was often depicted holding a flute or a lyre. She was said to inspire musicians and composers to create beautiful melodies and harmonies. Euterp's name means delightful or pleasing and she was often called upon to bring joy and happiness to people through her music. Elpomene, the muse of tragedy. Elpomene was the muse of tragedy and was often depicted holding a tragic mask. She was said to inspire playwrights and poets to create works that explored the darker side of human emotions, such as grief, sorrow, and despair. Elpomene's name means to sing or to celebrate with song, and she was often called upon to help people find meaning in their suffering through her tragic poetry. Polyhymnia, the muse of hymns. Polyhymnia was the muse of hymns and was often depicted holding a lyre or a veil. She was said to inspire poets and musicians to create hymns and songs of praise to the gods. Polyhymnia's name means many hymns, and she was often called upon to help people connect with the divine through her music and poetry. Terpsichore, the muse of dance. Terpsichore was the muse of dance and was often depicted holding a lyre or a plectrum. She was said to inspire dancers and choreographers to create beautiful and graceful movements. Terpsichore's name means delight in dancing, and she was often called upon to help people express their emotions and tell stories through dance. Thalia, the muse of comedy. 
Thalia was the muse of comedy and was often depicted holding a comic mask. She was said to inspire playwrights and poets to create works that explored the lighter side of human emotions, such as joy, laughter, and happiness. Thalia's name means blooming, and she was often called upon to help people find joy and laughter in their lives through her comic poetry. Urania, the muse of astronomy. Urania was the muse of astronomy and was often depicted holding a globe or a celestial sphere. She was said to inspire astronomers, scientists, and philosophers to study the heavens and to explore the mysteries of the universe. Urania's name means heavenly or of the sky, and she was often called upon to help people understand the wonders of the cosmos through her poetry and music. Each of the nine muses had a unique area of expertise, from epic poetry to dance to comedy. Their influence can still be felt today in the arts as people continue to draw inspiration from their stories and their legacies. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more mythology content. What other gods and goddesses would you like us to cover? Let us know in the comments below.